Hello and welcome. Today we are doing an epic birthday haul. My boyfriend took me on an epic shopping spree uh, yesterday. So this is everything I got from TJ Maxx, H&M, and Ulta. I am very, very picky about clothes and about things that I buy. I want to actually be able to use them every day. I want to actually have a need and a use for it for the most part. These are all clothes that I've needed, brushes that I've needed, things that I've needed, and they're just like little upgrades and they're gonna make my life easier. So I'm gonna start with the Ulta bag because it's the smallest. First thing I got from Ulta, I was going and looking for a brush for fine thin hair. The very nice man that worked there brought me back to this thing. This is supposed to be the ultimate TikTok detangling brush. They were, all the stylists in Ulta were saying like that they all have one of these brushes and use them on their clients as well. This is the, oh, unbrush mini, untangle, unknot, undo. So he said to use it in the shower whenever you have conditioner on or like a hair mask or something. What he explained to me about this brush, he showed me a regular brush and how they're usually like circle kinda and kinda stand up in the middle like that. This brush, it has all the rows, so it's actually meant to go through your hair on every single way, like you can see through it. Super stoked about this purchase. I think it was like maybe 10 or $15. This brush, I already unboxed it. It's just for my scalp treatment. I think this was like six bucks. I also needed some primer. I love the brand e.l.f. I think that it, I have really sensitive skin. It's never broken out my skin yet. So this is the Power Grip Primer. I think that this literally stays all night and makes my face like glue. Like I literally, everything will stick to it. And this is the Stay All Night Micro Fine Setting Mist. This stuff is really, really awesome as well. My gift from Ulta because it was my birthday. They gave me this little Kristen S hair mask. I didn't really know anything about this, but the girl at the counter said that it was color safe. All right, let's move on to TJ Maxx, which I am super, super stoked about. Brayden helped me pick out and like made me buy a bunch of stuff at TJ Maxx, which I am so grateful for. What do you even call this? This was $12.99 at TJ Maxx. It's like a little jewelry stand. You can put stuff in the bottom right here. These are wood. And then you can hang up all your rings, um, necklaces, earrings, stuff up here. And I always need stuff to just like take off my jewelry like the day, the night of and just plop it somewhere. So that's why I'm gonna put like my jewelry, like small jewelry. I'm so excited about that. These are some earrings. I had her mark them down 10% because they were missing a gem out of there. I'm planning on wearing the middle set probably. And then these ones up here, the little small ones, they can go and this earring right here inside my cartilage because I have trouble finding the flat backs um, for that cartilage piercing. Got her to mark them down to $15. I think it's a pretty good deal for that type of earring set. This is one of my favorite things that I got literally all day. Ah! You guys, I found these Ugg their earmuffs. Literally stop. Like, come on. Come on. It does not get much better than that. And I've been wanting earmuffs because sometimes at work, like I have to stand outside for a period of time and it just really, really, it's been really chilly here in Missouri. And so I want to have something that like, I want to have something that I can put on, keep my ears warm, but it doesn't mess up my hair for work. Just this was something I saw and I just could not live without it. I think these were only like 40 at TJ Maxx my little splurge purchase. I was so happy about that. This is still TJ Maxx. I needed a new blanket for my bed. For this blanket, I didn't want it to be too big, did not want it to be too small. It had to be the right texture. It had to be soft enough, but also thin enough that I wouldn't get too, um, too cold, but not too thick so I wouldn't get too hot. This is my big queen slash, slash full size blanket. <laughs> I'm so excited. I want to take it home. Or I need to wash it, actually. <laughs> this is our last bag from TJ Maxx. Brayden found this Hydro Flask. Can you guys see that? Hydro Flask lunchbox. I think it was 40 and it was 30 bucks. So it unzips like this. There's two zippers and it opens up and it's like a cooler and it probably will keep your stuff dry or stuff cold all day long. I was like, Yes, I need, I want. I like weird things that like nobody else really has or has seen before. And this just like hit the mark for me. Look at this freaking lunchbox. And it's got so much space. Like I feel like you could put 
a can and an ice pack and a sandwich and chips and like your whole stuff in here so i was really excited about this one it's about to be winter so i also did get this really really soft scarf i actually forgot to look at what brand it was pretty persuasions this was 15 dollars, but i needed to splurge and get a scarf this is so soft and so long i feel like i can just throw it over bundle up put my earmuffs on actually no i won't right now and then i also got these gloves they were 10 9.99 10 dollars and they are i tested them out first they're small mediums they're eye touch they're called hot paws um and i feel like they fit so so well and they have the eye touch on the finger and on uh, on your pointer finger and on your thumb okay super stoked about that one the last thing from tj maxx i did get a five pack of beauty blenders i don't know if you guys can see these but i just needed some basic beauty blenders um because i feel like i don't want to be patting my face with mold constantly <laughs> so that is it from tj maxx let's move on to h&m We'll do the small bag first. First thing I got from H&M, this cute, 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 I have always wanted and never had. Brayden had to convince me to buy this and this other thing later, but puffer vest, hello, literally fits me perfectly. It's so cute. Your basic black puffer vest, but I'm just figuring like with my scarf and my gloves and my Uggs and earmuffs, like, I'm gonna be that it girl, okay? I have been trying to build my wardrobe recently. I need basics like black, white, gray t-shirt that fit well, black, white, gray, long sleeve shirt, black, white, gray, sweatpants, um, good pair of blue jeans, dark jeans, black jeans, maybe no holes in them. Uh, so it's just been like a struggle to find good quality clothing um, that's not gonna fall apart in like a month. So I went to H&M, I got these long sleeves and i'm not really into crop stuff anymore i figured out that i'm kind of like a low-waisted um long shirt kind of girl and i definitely could wear a crop top with like high-waisted jeans or whatever but i just like i just as i am getting older <laughs> my old age of 23 i don't like the crop tops anymore i just want to be covered and like just maybe show a little bit of skin i feel like it's more demure right these um long sleeve shirts i couldn't find my size in a, in a white but I got this color and then this is like almost like a dolphin gray color. But I like these because they don't have that big like collar. Like it's just very simple and slim. So those are the two long sleeve shirts that I got. Oh, also they're not see-through. They're like a good skims almost material. That is why I got those ones. Now we will move on to the big bag. I am a stripes kind of girl. I got this sweater for fall and winter. I am like big in oversized stuff. I don't know if you've seen any of my other stuff on my channel, but like oversized anything I am there. I love that this is a V-neck and not like a weird neck. I love the collar that there's no like collars, like flaps or anything around my neck. And it's just huge oversized. I can wear it with probably leggings. I can wear it with jeans. I can wear it with literally anything. Super cute. I love how the sleeves are kind of cuffed too, but not too much to where you could roll them up. The sun is like, blinding me let's get y'all closer shall we these are pants they're sweatpants super soft on the inside i don't usually like tie pants but these ones i'm in an exception for oh these were 30. yikes i just needed a splurge and get some basic things so these are ribbed kind of like in the middle um but they are super super soft sweatpants on the inside like I am a person who cares about tags and itchy clothes and things that are uncomfortable. Like I have to have soft, comfortable clothing for me to last in that like outfit all day. These are wide leg at the bottom. Um, I just needed some basic black sweatpants. I think that these will hold up for a really long time. And that is why I wanted to invest money, my boyfriend's money into buying those sweatpants. This is a plain black crew neck and i like how this one like it hits me at just the right length like over my butt and kind of like in between my like thighs um the collar is perfect it's so so soft on the inside velvety i'm sure once i wash it it'll stay the same um and again i do like this sleeve i'm very picky about like the sleeve length because i like to roll my sleeves like that this is literally the perfect sweatshirt these are black and white t-shirts they remind me of skims but they're a little bit maybe thinner on the thinner side one more thing about these long sleeve shirts so this dolphin gray one in the white and i'm pretty sure all of them 
Do you guys see in the sun? But it has this like cover right here underneath. Let me see if I can show you on the other side. It has this cover underneath. I personally think this is a great shirt where it's not see-through. So if you get the white one, it's not going to be see-through in that one spot on the top. So like if you didn't want to wear a bra or maybe your bra is like a different color or something, it's definitely not going to show through the shirt. Like I was saying, these t-shirts, they are skims in my eyes. I just needed some basic t-shirts that were long enough, came all the way down to the bottom of my torso, just were comfy. Um, I feel like I could just wear a nude bra with this. It is kind of see-through, which I don't usually like, but I just really needed these t-shirts. So I got black. And I got white and they didn't have the gray in my size. And last but not least from H&M, probably tied with my second favorite purchase from H&M. Freaking puffer coat. So it's like a dolphinish gray color. Oh, literally the cutest. But they cinch right here at the bottom. I think that this was overall, this was $49.99. But I needed a medium jacket. I have a really big heavy coat with a fur hood and like it's like water resistant and I can get down and dirty in this in this other coat but I just needed like a medium coat whenever it's just fall and I don't want to have it all the way down to my my coat all the way down to my knees <laughs> but this one is so freaking adorable and the sleeves I really really like the sleeves they're kind of like an elastic kind of sleeve right there it doesn't come out like I do usually like something to cover my like onto my gloves like that but this one if it's just for like a medium cold day i think that this will just work just fine i love how it crops right here but yeah this coat is literally i put it on and was like this coat is to die for so i was unboxing all of my stuff and like putting it away i forgot to mention that i my wonderful boyfriend got me these versace sunglasses literally the best part of my whole birthday hello hello i'm shelly duvall um i just had to throw that in there really quickly because somehow it slipped my mind whenever i was unpacking stuff so probably my favorite purchases were that coat the black puffer vest hydro flask um lunchbox and my ugg earmuffs which i'm literally so stoked about i'm so sorry i didn't vlog much of my birthday i just got to spending time with my mom and my dad and my boyfriend and my friends and i was just like i just need to stay off my phone this is too precious to not live in the moment um, during these kind of birthday memories. I did go and do a paint and sip with my friends last night and we watched Bodies, Bodies, Bodies and um, that new Anna Kendrick movie on Netflix. I, the name is escaping me right now. But I literally am so grateful for everything that I have. I'm grateful for my parents and my boyfriend and my wonderful friends. They're just, I am very, very lucky and thankful and know the position that I am in um, to be able to have all these things. I will catch you guys in the next vlog. Bye!